school, all of the kids are finally back to school. If you're a parent, you know, in Virginia especially, lots of people went back to school today. Yep. And I probably had to pack a few lunches. Today's the big day. That's and right. if the packed lunch is cheap and easy, sometimes it means it's salty and fatty. But Tanya Mercer is here to help. She's going to make sure your sack lunches are cheap and healthy. That's right. Do tell. Yes. <laughs> so, you know, first of all, I want to say I made these five lunches this morning. Okay. And it, and it took me about 35 minutes to make all five, and that's from scratch. And I had to cook pasta, I have to cook rice and beans, and so it can be done also quickly. That's good to point. know, because I think yeah. a lot of people think, oh, I, I don't have time in the morning. I don't have time. Right. Yeah. But I mean, you Absolutely. said five and 35, divide that, you do the math, there that's you right. go. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So, so, yeah, and then I also went and I added up everything, and basically these five lunches, including the snack that comes with it or the side dish mm -hmm. are anywhere between a dollar nine and a dollar fifty five each per lunch per lunch which wow. is I have a, a child in public school and public schools are allotted in DC about two dollars and seventy five cents per child for okay. lunch and everyone says that's too little that's too little you can't get healthy food for that much right. and you know I did it and I'm using store-bought things which is marked up whereas right. you know, they schools get, get discounted. Yeah, right. Absolutely. right so one idea I want to start with is the classic peanut butter and jelly right so yeah. I have one over there on That's whole wheat good. bread um, and in that one I actually use sunflower seed butter if you want I just it. tried yeah. that recently. Someone yeah. in the office What'd you had think? it. It's good. It's good. It tastes kind of like peanut butter, right? At first right? I thought, I don't know about this, but yeah. Is yeah. it less salt than peanut butter? What, what makes it more healthy than using just regular peanut butter? Well, it what makes it, well, it has a little bit more vitamin E than peanuts. It's from sunflower seeds, right. but the big deal about sunflower seed butter is now a lot of schools are going peanut free. Right. And moms peanut are like, allergies. what do you mean <laughs> peanut free? I can't do peanut, and, and also nut free, so there's also right. almond butter they can't do either. Sunflower seed butter is the only one that they could do, and I give it to my son, and he does not, I, I interchange it between that and peanut butter, and he can't tell the difference. Fantastic. So it's a great. You fooled him, I love it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and you know, it's, it's inexpensive. You get the whole jar for two bucks. You can even get organic one for two dollars. It's, it's really not that much. And nice. then you pair that up with a nice apple, and you've got a nice wholesome lunch there, and a drink. What's next to the PB&J? So that's pizza. Now that is pizza on an English muffin. It's just I even I even bought the pizza sauce. I didn't make it myself because it's it's like a dollar nine for a, a jar a of jar, yeah. pizza sauce. It's really good. It's just basically tomato paste and some spices, and you spread that on an English muffin. You put in some spinach and then you hide the spinach with the cheese on top. See, how you, you have to hide the greens. I knew I was like, you know, what do we have hiding in yeah. there? Yeah, yeah. Um, and you can even make that the night before. You can have it all ready to go in the morning. Pop it in the toaster oven. It takes one minute and it's ready to go. So, and, and that's, you know, that's pretty wholesome lunch. And then you can pair that up with some sliced peaches. And it's pretty right. filling. Now, could you make this and toast it in the morning and then send it in their lunch box and they could have it hours later? Yeah, absolutely. Fantastic. Yeah, that'll be good for this, this lunchtime today because I toasted it this morning. Um, another oh, idea, yeah. Pasta. Pasta. So this I call um, rainbows and butterflies pasta because it's rainbow colors. You're getting, and when you make fun names like that, That's the right. kids want to eat that. Easier for them to eat, <laughs> right? yeah. Even though there's peas and corn in there. Just don't say the, the vegetable words, That's right? right. That's right. Don't say them. veggie. Yeah. Rainbows. <laughs> rainbows. Veggie, um, evil. And it's farfalle pasta. It's that bow tie pasta, but they kind of look like butterflies, so yeah. it's fun. And I tossed in just a little bit of Parmesan cheese in there. You guys are welcome to try it if you like. And that's a perfect a one for the lunchbox. You can put it in, you know, one of your totes that you have over here. Yes. Eat it cold. You don't have to worry about yeah. something going bad right. exactly. you know, during the day yeah. before their lunch hour. Exactly. Yeah. Now, when you use yeah. the peas, do you use frozen vegetables or do you I use did. fresh? Oh, yeah. yes, that's another good point. Okay, so we know pasta is inexpensive. You yeah. buy a whole thing of pasta for a dollar <laughs> or a dollar fifty. And then the, the vegetables, the reason why I love them, the frozen ones, is because you can get them organic and they cost so little, it's almost shocking. And you can buy a bag of frozen of these mixed veggies with corn, peas, and carrots for a dollar fifty. Wow. And it's a whole it lasts, bag. Yeah. It lasts five portions. Yeah. And what I do is I make the pasta, it takes ten minutes, I time it. So at eight minutes I throw in the frozen veggies in the same pot. You don't have to mess up another <laughs> pot and strain it all together and you toss it with cheese and and there voila. You go. And voila, right, it's I don't done. Know why you're being shy? But yeah, you, could try you are it. very hungry. I, am. I know there are vegetables in there. I told you, I've been up since you know. Odor go, go right ahead. We'll take over. You so, can sit there and eat. <laughs> so, <laughs> so you mentioned this lunch box. I love these lunch boxes. They are economical because you buy them once mm -hmm. and you use them the whole year round. And has everything in them. Perfect. And they're BPA free. They're you know they're good for the environment and so on. They don't have the plastic that leaches. And you can pack up all the little things in here. So in here I've got um, some dip that I made simply with using Greek yogurt and adding a little bit of garlic salt. 
and there's your ranch type dip. Yeah, it's a lot good. healthier. It's two ingredients only instead of you know 20 ingredients right. on your ranch Things bottle. Things you can't pronounce exactly. inside the bottle. And here you've got your cut up um, corn. Yeah, this is corn. <laughs> Carrots <laughs> and, cu and cucumbers. I was going to go on with it. <laughs> and, and the cool thing about buying your veggies and cutting them up, it takes an extra 30 seconds, but you, you're saving money that way instead of buying those. And everyone repackaged stuff everyone is loves, always more expensive. Yeah, and everyone loves those little baby carrots, and but you know they, they toss them with some kind of thing to keep them fresh. And yeah, it's got a yeah, it's got liquid a liquid in there. Yeah, I'm a yeah, little I don't know what, of yeah. That. and so it's a lot less expensive. A bag of organic carrots costs 69 cents. That's a whole bag of carrots. Yeah. so that can go so all week time. too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And um, um, tell us so before we go what yeah. you got going on over here. Okay, so here I have the hummus. So I just so make it fun for your kids. They can make this too. Put the little components. So you've got the hummus here in a little, you know, three-part dish here. You just spread it on your whole wheat tortilla. And when you use whole wheat and you make it fun for them, they don't realize that you're using whole wheat. And then they can come and sprinkle on, say, as much carrots as you want, as long as you're getting some carrots in there, it's okay. Mm -hmm. Some spinach, you could do sprouts. I'm making a little salad. Uh, decoration on your table here. <laughs> That's you a just, way to get them to eat yeah. the salad. Yeah. Too. You just roll it up and then you cut it in half and it's, you know, it's pretty. You put it like this in your lunch box and it lasts. You can even make this one the night before. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Here pretty go. and easy. Pretty and Tanya easy Mercer, and economical. Tanya Thank you so yeah. much. You're welcome. Oh, delicious. Pretty yeah. with some you. Of this. I was going to say, I might be eating <laughs> a little later. Yeah. <laughs> Check back with me a little later. <laughs> All right. Um,